Uh, ben Shibibo is losing his fucking minds. Uh, I have a controversial idea about paying off student loan debt. Don't take out debt you will likely be unable to pay off, and don't ask others to pay off your debts. I think what we should do is uh, also uh, uh, pull up the fucking Ben Shibibo shit. I'm gonna post the Daily Wire. Uh, I'm gonna post the Daily Wire numbers on that tweet. I'm gonna quote tweet that with the Big Daily Wire's number. And you should too. You should let the people know. You know what I mean? Did the Daily Wire take loans too or no? Did the Daily Wire take uh, loans? PPP Daily uh, Wire loans? No, not Ben Shapiro individually getting that. That's a sole proprietorship. No, that's the Daily Caller. No, that's Ben Shapiro. Okay. Wire to wire, Daily Wire, Bay Area Properties. Or it wouldn't be Daily Wire, right? That's Daily Caller, chat. Shut up. That's different. Daily Donut, Trenton Daily, 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 Karen Daily, Miana Daily. What the fuck? I'm on Daily Wire is owned by Bent Key Ventures, LLC. Are you sure? It's not coming up. Bent Key Ventures, LLC is not coming up with anything. It's been, it's, the owner is called Bent Key Ventures, LLC. What? Hassan Doan? What the fuck? What the fuck? A taxi service in Methuen, MA. Fountainhead, SPF, LLC, existing for two or it's not even my last name, you fucking idiot. That's my middle name. Check the Jeremy guy. I mean, this is this is limited liability. Bentley Capital Ventures in Tampa, Florida, received a paycheck protection of one hundred sixty-seven thousand. Why isn't it coming up on the on the ProPublica uh, thing though? The ProPublica tracker. I know Ben Shapiro personally got it. I know, I know, I have that already. I have that information. Also, this is Bentley Capital Ventures, not Bent Key. No, you're looking up Bentley Ventures. Oh my God, everyone is literally posting Bentley Ventures. <clears throat> also, I don't understand how you can be self-employed wait this is a different person by the way this is in kendall park new jersey i don't think this guy this is ben shapiro either this is literally offices of real estate agents and brokers this is a completely different ben shapiro you guys are the worst dude okay guys i'm gonna exp explain something to you this is not the real ben shapiro this is not the real ben shapiro and this is the daily caller this is not the daily wire daily wire is this is not ben shapiro chat Oh, Los Angeles, offices of real estate agents and brokers. Wait, what? Okay, this might be him. This is actually him. This is a, this is probably him for his own like real estate business or something. Or maybe not. A lot of you do not know how to do reading, like critical critical reading. Apologize to chat chatters. Ben Shapiro is a common name, but what you are but what you are forgetting is that Daily Caller is not the Daily Wire. The Daily Caller News Foundation is a separate. It's Tucker Carlson's operation. What you would need to have, what you would need to have is the Daily Wire. The Daily Wire or Bent Key. Bent Key. Key. Shatters with 117 ProPublica Safari windows open their phone and battery at 1% posing the wrong guy. Or whatever the, the other larger company is. Okay, there's a Ben Shapiro that's a real estate broker. Okay, so it's probably, this Ben Shapiro is probably not even him. What you need to find out is if Ben Shabibo, his, his company actually took uh, loans. He didn't even hide it well. You need to understand. He didn't hide it well. Uh, chatters are just fucking, I mean, I, I don't want to, I don't want to dive into it currently, but it's not like you need to hide it well. You just need one umbrella corporation. That's it. And uh, and Chatters didn't even fucking know that. So which streamer outsources work to take down prominent talk show hosts? I mean, I'm not even doing that because it's not good work. Outsourcing is not good in this situation. What's the point if he took loans? His point was about getting loans you can't pay. The fuck do you mean? He took out loans that he couldn't pay for. If he took out PPP loans, he literally took loans knowing full well that uh, those loans would get uh, uh, those loans were going to be forgiven. I would like to know because it is a direct contradiction to the c fucking uh, commentary.